Have you ever wondered how soccer players can bend the ball? We're going to do an awesome experiment to find out. Whoa, that was awesome. Jojo Science Show! Hey y'all, welcome to Jojo Science Show. Today we're going to make cup spinners or cup gliders. Hey look, I just lost a tooth. That reminds me of a joke. What do you call a bear with no teeth? Huh? A gummy bear. <laughs> For this experiment, you'll need two of the same cups. You can use styrofoam cups like these, or you can use little plastic cups like these. You'll need some tape. You're going to place the two cups end to end, and then you gotta tape it. Make sure you get your tape all the way around. It doesn't matter if you get a little extra. Now I'm gonna do the same thing with my little plastic cup. Look and see which one flies better. So they're both good. Now comes the rubber bands. <gasps> now we're going to make a rubber band launcher. So you can launch the cups and they'll go and they'll fall slowly. We're going to use about four rubber bands. You want to take this here rubber band and slide it through this one and then you take it like this. So now we do the same thing with the green. Now we have a cup launcher. Yep, it works. So let's try it with this big one. Do you see how the cup floats slowly to the ground? The rubber band launcher helps spin the cups as they're being launched. Wow, it's spinning, it works. That's so awesome. So how does this work? This works because of the Magnus effect, named after the German scientist H.G. Magnus, who first observed this effect in 1853. <laughs> the Magnus effect is why soccer players can bend the ball. The smileys are the air particles. When the ball is not spinning, the air particles just go straight past it. When the ball or the cup is spinning, it causes the air particles to move to one side. It creates high pressure on the side with the air particles and low pressure on the other side. This difference in pressure causes the ball to curve its flight or creates lift for the spinning cups. That's how you can bend it like Beckham, or like Magnus. When basketball players put backspin on the ball, then it helps set arc the shot. So it falls more like a rainbow, like this. So bend it like Magnus. Thanks for watching JoJo Science Show. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button down below, and subscribe to my channel so you can become a kid scientist too. And hit that bell so you won't miss any of my fun videos. Bing! And remember kids, science is fun! Shout out to Christopher Reed from Kylene, Texas. Thanks for watching! So you can bend it like pick up. <laughs>